the Tim Force, the Maiden Hurdle is the second race up. This is a three mile Maiden Hurdle. This time at the top, we've got Nashville Galaxy for Vinnie Gerard, Ruby Gallup, Daniel French, six of Crows, Padre Hogan, three Jokers for Obi Wan, Cruise on by Craig Beck with Flying Higher, Darren Thompson, Queen's Look, David Hooley, and Stolen Princess for Leon Van Rensburg. So, eight this time. We might suffer from some small fields this season as we get away then for this second race. We've got quite a few this week, but I've only got five or six runners in. And Cruise On By is the first one to show. There's plenty, plenty, of, winners, plenty of winners to go around for everybody, though, on the plus side. And also, means that commentating shouldn't be too difficult, but you might get a little bit bored of listening to me by the end of the season. Anyway, Cruise On By is in the lead. Leading by about a length to Nashville Galaxy in second. Three Jokers is third. And Ruby Gallup is the grey in the bright red jacket. But it's Cruise on by that leads into the first of the 12. They're all safely over that one. And Craig Beckwith Charge leads by about two lengths to three Jokers in second in the yellow jacket of Sirius Chill Obi One flying the flag for the American trainers on the jumps circuit this season. Nashville Galaxy in the green next to that one. Then wide on the track flying higher. And the Leon Van Rensburg horse just poking its way between them. He's a stolen princess, but they come up past the stand then with a couple of circuits still ahead of them. And Cruise on by. He's in the lead by about two lengths. To flying higher for Darren Thompson on the outside in the maroon jacket now just being overtaken by stolen princess for leon who's moved into a clear second now natural galaxy in the vinnie gerard green is fourth then comes three jokers in the yellow uh, closest to us is the other yellow jacket or six of crows padre hogan back over the jumps i think he was just a flat trainer last season back on the jump scene the gray is ruby gallop i think that's one of daniel french's i think he's going to be the Man of many colours again this season. He looks to change his silks around a lot. And David Hooley, who took the opener. And it's got the back marker at the moment. Queen's look. They're all still on their feet after three flights. And they're making their way down towards the fourth. They're inside the final two miles now. And Cruise on by. He's in the lead by about two to three lengths. Gets over that one nicely from Flying Higher in second. And Stolen Princess third. Nashville Galaxy fourth. And three jokers, Queen's Look, Six of Crows, and finally the Grey Ruby Gallop as they get over the fifth. All safely over that one as well. And all hurdling well. Or just a one faller in the opening race, and that was from the stable that leads this second race. So Greg Beckwith will be hoping for a bit better luck this time. And he got him the last race. Although to be fair, I think the horse was probably beaten at the time when it fell, but it ran a decent enough race, and it's cruise on by in the lead from Flying Iron in second, and Nashville Galaxy third, Stolen Princess is fourth, and then three Jokers, six Crows, and Ruby Gallop, and finally Queen's Luck at the back. Over flight number six they go, they're getting quite strong out now, and almost Indian five, but not quite, cruise on by the leader, by two. Flying higher second, he's about three lengths up on Nashville Galaxy as they take number seven. It's all over nicely with Queen's Look still the back marker. And Cruise on by in the lead by probably four now to Flying Higher second as they come up past the stands and past the winning post and they'll swing right handed now then for one more circuit of the track in this second race of the fourth SO7 season. I'm not quite sure how many seasons that have been in the SO series. It's not quite clear from Tom. It looks like it's 13, but I think there may have been one or two back in the early days that didn't register on that. But uh, for modern day purposes, we'll class this as season 13 and the fourth since we moved over to SO7. So everybody should be pretty much up to speed with SO7 now. And Cruise on by is the leader by about three lengths to six of crows second and then flying higher is third with queen's look fourth as they get over the eighth all safely over that one with ruby gallop the new back marker and queen's look who was the back marker is making 
pretty eye catching progress through the field. He's now into third place, trying to give David Hooley a quick double on the opening day. Mistake there was by Flying Iron. That one's just shuffling down the pack a little bit. But Cruz on by now, being pushed along, joined by Six of Crows, who looks to be going really well as well. Queen's Luck is in third as they get over the tenth. They've got two more flights to take there now, and it's Cruz on by who's in the lead. Six of Crows is second. Then comes Queen's Luck on the outside. Nashville Galaxy trying to get back in it. It's Golden Princess is still there, Flying Iron trying to run on again. Ruby Gallop trying to make a bit of ground. The one struggling at the back is three jokers, but it's Cruz on by who leads by about a length. And in second place is Nashville Galaxy. Six of Crows being pushed along now on the inside. Flying Iron trying to get back into it. Queen's Luck hits a bit of a flat spot. Stolen Princess is trying to get into it. Ruby Gallop's trying to come wide. They've got two and a half furlongs and two flights to go. And it's Cruz on by in the lead by a length and a half. Two Nashville Galaxies. They race to the second last. Over that one they go. We see them from behind as they go over it. They're racing down towards the final flight now. And it's Cruz on by who's still in the lead. Led all the way. Leads by three to Nashville Galaxy in second. Over the final flight they go. And Cruz on by landed in the lead. Nashville Galaxy's trying to close. So to his stolen princess. But Cruz on by looks to be going well enough in the lead. And he's going to be a first winner of the season for Craig Beckwith as they race up towards the line. It's going to be Cruz on by who takes the tin for the maiden hurdle. Nashville Galaxy is going to be second. Six of Crows is third. Close for fourth. Queens lock stolen princess. Then flying eye Ruby Gallup. And finally, three jokers. So, pillar to post, pretty much for Cruz on by, who lived up to his name and cruised on by that winning post with two and a half lengths in hand from Nashville Galaxy in second and six of Crows third. But it's Cruz on by, the winner for Craig Beckwith, Nashville Galaxy second for Vinnie Gerard, six of Crows, Padraig Hogan was third, Queen's Look for David Hooley fourth, and Stolen Princess for Leon Van Rensburg was fifth.